show is that we've come to the end of the show. And so how do how do how do we end it? How do we end it? One last word. Did I get it close, Sean? Was that close to the way Sean would do it? I don't know. Yeah, buddy. one last word, of course. This is this is yeah, yeah, but it is where we, we take that opportunity <laughs> while I'm stuttering to find the banner to put up, you know, because Nick is slow and it's been one of those days. But uh yeah, we got one last word. Let's go around to each other. Uh Anthony, Mr. Fingers, sticky fingers, lady fingers, whatever other kind of fingers you have. We'll go ahead and start with you, my friend. What is your one last word? I'll do it again. I remind you, this is our final show of the season, so let's make it a good one. <sighs> oh, he said he said I'm straight for this. Hold on. Here it comes. He, I'm he sorry. I had, to, I had to gather <laughs> myself because you were running through the whole litany of nicknames, and you threw one out there that just kind of <laughs> made me go, oh. And I had to, I had to collect myself and Delilah <laughs> almost fell out of her chair. So, uh, all right, I'm back. Um, all right. Word, my word. I don't. I don't know. I want to. I kind of want to make mine fun. I want to make mine fun because no, always, whatever we, you want, man. Of course, because we always go so. We always go so philosophical. You know what I mean? No, oh, sure, uh, absolutely. And, and, nothing, and there's nothing. There's absolutely nothing wrong with going philosophical. I just want to end this on a fun note. My my word for the day is uh, unity. I, I I can't say that without hearing uh, unity. Uh, right. right. I can't. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Something of Queen Latifah. Huh? Oh, I was you, well, that's, I -I. oh. No, but we think right, you and I T Y with right. Dave Chappelle with Derek okay. James. Oh, yeah. see <laughs> here. <laughs> Sorry, let's think of the Queen. But go ahead. <laughs> but um, <laughs> unity. It's the first word that comes to mind. Uh, actually, I got another one for you, Delilah. Unit. That is the key word, and that is the key portion of unity, turds. Without the Y, major pain. <laughs> um. Major anyway, girl, yeah. You. I love that movie. Uh. You. <laughs> Mess myself up. Unity. I think that is important. You broke me. You broke me, Nick. Um, it's important, you know, um, to just to just we we've been through a whole bunch of stuff as of late, but I have found that you just gotta find ways to still unite with other people and find something to do to keep you keep to to uh to keep yourself moving, to keep yourself motivated. Like you know, when we did the when we uh, when we did the thing that we did, and you you specifically, Nick, talked about you gave me something to do other than to go to work and to come home. This yeah. is given, you know, I am um, I'm about as housebound as they, I'm about as housebound as they come me and my family, and this is, yeah. you know, this is hey, I'm hanging out with my friends and I'm talking sports. It's great, right? I'm exactly. enjoying myself. I'm having a good time, uh, and it, it just gives me something to take my mind off of. Oh, there's the alarm clock. It's time for me to get up. Ooh, it's 7.58. I got to log on at 8 o'clock. Hang on a second. I'm yeah. logged on. Let me sleep another five minutes. You know what I'm saying? It's right. like, not yeah. that I actually, not that I do that or anything like that. Not at all. Not at all. Sir. Anyway, but I, it just gives me, it gives you something to do. So find ways to reach out to people around you. It doesn't have to be a podcast. It doesn't, it doesn't have to be a podcast. It could be, you know everybody was real big in all of this stuff in the beginning of the pandemic where we were all doing all kinds of great things and singing we are the world and doing all kinds of great <laughs> things we're trying very, to do all kinds true. of great things on zoom but I, I just think that fine take some time to reunite with the go. folks that are important to you because for sure we lost we lost touch with a lot of people that, that are that we say are important to us as we draw further into ourselves and this is great this is a perfect example. I didn't know you guys before last year. Now I'm yeah, sitting here on this show. Three months, four months ago, I think, right? Like we, you're kind nah, of I, I, met you, I met group? you guys. I met you guys when we did the draft show last year. Because oh, I was it okay? Was it? Was yeah, because because you, 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 you know because you know because you know uh, uh, Shay Shay had to come on and have a little something because yeah, you know I was that what it is? talking <laughs> about the Atlanta Falcons draft pick. You know? oh, oh, that's right. There you go. Yeah, wow. you were. That's right. I'm sorry. Had we were, little, had we were, we in, we were in a bar and we were a bit lit. But yeah, you're right. You think oh, yeah. we're on the show. <laughs> oh, that's, right. I, I forgot. Right. that's why y'all right. don't remember. Somebody was right. at my buddies, my right. buddies. <laughs> anyway, 
but uh, I, I didn't even know you guys a year ago, and now yeah, I'm, I'm not only doing I'm doing this show with you. I'm doing wow, another show man. with my homeboy Colin. Uh, like every now and twice. again, uh, it, it, uh, 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 you know, there's uh, uh, I'm doing a show with you now, Nick. Uh, yeah. So you know, we're, <laughs> it, it, and it's something. Oh wait, are you guys seeing the show? Is that the popcorn and movies thing? Yes, it came back. Yes, yes. once again, yeah. that's right. It's back. Once again, you have judged correctly, Lisa McDowell. Um, <laughs> <laughs> there it is. So it's unity. That's my word for the day. Because I can talk mm-hmm. about it for I can talk about it for a long time yes. and yes. Mm-hmm. get the preacher voice on and start <laughs> preaching about it. But I didn't come here today to tell you that the race Absolutely. is given to the swift or the battle to the strong. That's right. I didn't come here to tell you why the birds fly up in the sky. I come to talk to you right. about. A uh, 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 philosophy that was given to us right. by the young yeah. prophetess Dana Owens in the oh, 1990s. Wow. U-N-I-T-Y. Yes. Spell <laughs> unity. Yes. That's right. <laughs> Well, I don't know what it well man, I don't know if you talked that to what was I don't that? know, I but I, I like how you used her government name, but it's right. all good. Dana Owens. <laughs> Boy, you act like she hiding from the FBI on some on some Suge Knight charges. I don't know something. when she's ever gone by Dana. Yeah. <laughs> right. It's on no. Google. No, I know, but she don't go with, but no, it's funny. No, you're good. Cleo no, uh, show up at my house. <laughs> That's right. There you go. Uh, we'll, we'll be we'll be setting it off on my front. She doesn't even use Dana Owens for her show, The Equalizer. All right, she uses <laughs> Queen Latifah. Anyway, no, that was funny. All right, go ahead, I love you, I love you, girl. No, my word. no. So my my word is like humility and be humble. Now I know people hear that and like humility doesn't mean that you shouldn't be successful and right. that you shouldn't fight for what you need and that you shouldn't be proud of your accomplishments and that you shouldn't be happy where you're at right no and i feel like people confuse that stuff but humility means that when you do kind of attain or you're just kind of remember those around you right that's all it is i i feel like people always confuse humility and make it seem like you have to be meek humility is not meekness right and it's like so it's just you know remember who you are remember where you came from and just like you know just kind of be humble, you know, not to quote Kendrick Lamar, you know, because it's, you know, there's nothing wrong with that. And then again, it doesn't mean you shouldn't strive for success. It doesn't mean you shouldn't be proud of what you've done. And it doesn't mean that you shouldn't be selfish sometimes for yourself in order to be healthy mentally and physically. But also that it's sometimes okay to to remember to be humble, you know, um, in certain cir- circumstances. And so. You know, that's my my end. It's like be humble, show some humility. It'll it'll take us a long way. Yeah. Agreed. Agreed. Um, okay, I guess it's my turn then. Uh so um well I'm gonna take I'm gonna take probably a couple minutes, so this may take a little longer than but I thanks is my big word, my one last word for this. Uh, because as you know, this is our last show of the season for now uh this is the first year of let's talk football the round table um and as a lot of you know it started with me sean and delilah or sean delilah and i however you want to pronounce that um and it started with just us basically wanting to talk football i mean and it totally morphed into something that i couldn't have uh of even dreamed of like everything that's happened in this last year (laughs) with doing a live draft show and being on every tuesday night or monday i did we did some mondays then we went to Tuesdays, like, you know, <laughs> and did a couple of other days in between, right. did a Thursday or two once, you know, like whatever. But just being grateful and thankful to have a platform to do this and to have the opportunity, um, you know, so the things go out, of course, first to Sean Spencer. This was his vision. This started with him. You know, the three of us started just talking football, me, him, and Delilah, and it morphed into this show. Uh, <laughs> Janae Struther. Janae, obviously – you and Sean started doing the football talk to begin with, which then went to, you know, you guys branching off and, and, and doing other things, which is great with the Thursday night woman show and, and, and other things. Um, you know, I, I'd like to thank everyone who came on t- to our show as a guest, you know, starting with, uh, you know, the man below on the screen here who became a regular part of the show this last month and a half or so, uh, you know, Mr. Fingers, thank you very much, sir. 
uh, for all you've done with the show. Appreciate that. Our guy, Nathan Snell, you know, Nate has always been a good contributor. He's got his own, you know, big Nate podcast, but has always been willing to come on and talk sports with us, talk football, whatever. Uh, Nate, we appreciate you, my friend. To our other family, you know, I was we got Katie Alverson, we've got Ash Swinton, Sydney Swinton, David Wright, Bobby Wills, Will Kramer, Ablo, everybody who's, who's appeared on the show over the last year. Hope I didn't miss anyone. Whoever else, thank you. So how contrib- did you forget Dylan? Well, our contributor. Well, I was going to get to him in a minute. Our contributors <laughs> to here, you know, Wendy is always watching. Cat Hughes has always been a huge supporter. Uh, you know, uh, like I said, everybody's watched. Uh, Kyle, uh, you know, D- Dylan is a special kid. Uh, for those of you who watch our Sunday show, <laughs> you know how special that kid is. 14 years old, guy knows more than I'll ever know in my 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 feeble mind. That kid retains information like nobody's business. Um, you know, so really, I want to thank everyone who has made this last year of Let's Talk Football the Roundtable as special as it's been to me. I mean, I love coming on here every Tuesday to talk with you guys. You know, never did I never did I think I'd be hosting the show. To be honest with you, that was not in the cards initially. You know, Sean was always the host, but you know, we made a transition, and I hope that transition went well. And I hope you all enjoyed that transition again, which allowed us to transition into bringing on, you know, Mr. Fingers, Mr. Handy, bringing Nate on to kind of you know round out the hosting part of it. So again, I want to thank all of you. Uh you know, just thank everybody who's watched over the last year, who's contributed in any way, whether it's comments, watching, you know, an encouraging note, whatever. Because, you know, in the end, man, we're all just here trying to have a good time, right? We all, we all live. We're all trying to do the best we can. We all have our jobs. We all have our other things uh, that can be stressful. But this is a time for us to come together and just have a little fun. And so I hope it's always that for everyone. I hope you always, uh, you know, uh, you know, we'll always be here again. We're coming back. There'll be a season two of Let's Talk Football the Roundtable. Uh, so we're going to take, you know, t- to that note, we will be taking a few weeks off here. We're all going to, you know, get re-energized and get ourselves going again and <laughs> get some things done, some spring cleaning. Uh, we will be back sometime in March. Uh, we'll do some pre-draft stuff, talk about all the coaching changes, see where that goes, uh, and all that stuff in preparation for the draft at the end of April. So again, and then when we come back for watching, oh, what? when we come back, I'm making waffles. There you go. <laughs> as, long, as, long, as long as you don't forget the syrup, my brother, never forget no, the syrup. No, sir. Cannot have waffles without the syrup. Without syrup. That's right. <laughs> oh. But seriously, thank you all. Thank you all for watching. We really do appreciate you. And uh, all I can say is one last time for the Let's Talk Football family below me. As always, the man, the myth, the legend, Mr. Sticky Fingers, also known as Anthony Handy, my lovely co-host from day one and the longest-running segment, as we like to say here <laughs> on Red Sox Football, the roundtable, uh, diversity with the live course, Delilah Crespo, a dear friend of mine. I'm Nick Rosario, and nobody else ever will be. No, I'm <laughs> Thank you guys all for watching. Have a great week, seriously, and we'll see you on the flip side. Bye. Hey, what's going on, guys? Good show, bro. Hello, everybody. Hey, what's going on, guys? I am Janae Strother. I'm Sean Spencer. We are back. We are back, ladies and gentlemen. I gotta go out and let. Hold up. All right, all right, all right. I am Janae Struthers. I am Sean Spencer. And this is Let's Talk Football.